I was a military brat. I was born in Germany, hopped around. Savannah is where I called home. That's where my dad retired, so I spent most of my adolescence there in Savannah until I moved up to Atlanta for college. I would describe myself as an artist, as someone who likes to put a lot of meaning in my work, telling a story through my work. I like to use a lot of my life experiences. My last job, they asked me to lead these community murals for a couple years, and I fell in love with it. At the end of 2018, I decided to leave and go full-time in doing public art and using art to make an impact. So the title of my piece is called Terry's Heart. So Terry's Heart is inspired by my Auntie Terry who passed last May. She was like a second mother to me, a pillar in the family, and a great example of love. One of her favorite animals was an elephant. One of the things I learned from grief is it's that love that's, that has no place to go. It feels heavy, and, and I feel like that's also a representation of like an, an elephant, like the heaviness, the colossalness of it. I thought it would be really cool to illustrate those elephants in the piece, which is also a representation of strength, wisdom, and family. And there's a sun and a sunset, that sun representing hope representing life cycles and things. And so ultimately, I wanted this piece to represent continuing that, in, uh, that journey, but also cherishing those memories of our, of our loved ones, holding on to that wisdom and that love that they gave us. To be a part on Art on the Belt Line is a true honor. It's something that I've been wanting to do for the longest. When you go on the Belt Line and you're walking and running or riding your bike, you will see a, a gradient of yellow, similar to a sunset or a sunrise. You'll see these big, beautiful creatures, and you'll see a face. It's a memory of just remembering our loved ones, that they're always with us in our journey, in our life.